We got a better look at the giant cleanup job at an old army plant. The Department of Defense started removing more than 300 tons of contaminated soil at the Tar Heel Army missile site. A federal report found toxic chemicals from the plant in the surrounding area. WFMY News 2's Nixon Norman learned more about the cleanup job and if anyone's at risk. That's right, Sydney, a complicated situation. That's how Burlington's mayor describes the cleanup. He says there's still a lot of research to be done, timelines to be laid out, and major cleanup efforts to continue. One of the main focuses is transparency with the citizens of Burlington. Western Electric site in Burlington has been sitting on contaminated soil for years. It has always been a contaminated property. City of Burlington's Mayor Jim Butler says complaints have been pouring in regarding the site for the past two decades. Miguel Garcia has lived right next to the site for 20 years. He says he is worried about the contamination. I like this house. I like this. This, you know, this is my, it's my creek. You know, it's my house. You know, I love it here, but uh, I'm worried. Yes, I'm worried. Mayor Butler says talk of cleanup efforts really picked up in 2022. He says while the city is not responsible for the mess, the city played a major role in getting cleanup efforts started. The U.S. Army and previous property owners are responsible since the city does not own the land. The primary contamination is soil. That's uh, what we're most concerned about. And as elected leaders and, and uh, good stewards of our community, uh, we were concerned about uh, is there a human health risk? According to a report from a federal contractor, water and soil in the area contain toxic chemicals. The city says it's not known if there is a threat to anyone. As for now, soil is being removed and replaced, and more research is being done on the water there. Mayor Butler says continued research will take place over the next 15 to 18 months by the U.S. Army and DEQ. At this time, there is no telling when cleanup efforts will be completed. We will keep you updated.